25 cars are lined up on pit road. You know what that means. It's time for another weekend of Alpine Stars NASCAR Cup Series live on the Competition Racing Network booth. Hello, everybody. My name is Jack Roberts, and I'm with Scott Miles and Connor Speed. Good evening. I'm Scott Miles, and I'm Connor Speed. And we're getting you ready for what will be an exciting day of racing. The and the Folds of Honor Coca-Cola 500. 500 miles around this raceway here in Atlanta Motor Speedway. And now it's time to go get your drivers to watch for. Today's, this week's drivers to watch for are brought to you by 3M. 3M, applied to science, applied to life. Gunner, thanks guys. Casey Kane is going to be a driver to watch for as he won the 2014 event and starts from the pole. Kurt Busch won the 2010 event. He's a driver to watch for. Carl Edwards scored his first Cup Series win in Atlanta. He'll be a man to watch for. Bobby Labonte has six wins and is a man, will be a threat this week. Jeff Gordon won the 1998 event and the 2011 event. Driver to watch for. Jimmy Johnson won 2006, 15, and 16 events. He'll be a driver to watch for. Keselowski, the most recent Cup Series winner at Atlanta. And let's look at your rookies. Ryan Blaney starts, is in this field. Also returning is Chase Elliott. He starts second. Again, Sam Hornish Jr., he's in this field, and he's starting high up there. Tyson Aquino also resuming cup competition this week. Austin Rogers making a resume this week. And finally, for Neon Racing, they debut Scott Speed in the number 35 Chevrolet. It's time for a moment of silence to honor our fallen heroes. If it wasn't for them, we would not be racing today. And now it's time to go get the command. Gentlemen, start your engines! 25 cars roar to life, and let's go get a look at the starting lineup brought to you by Sunoco. Sunoco fueling victories. On the front row, we have Casey Kane and Chase Elliott. Starting in row number two, we have Carl Edwards and Michael Lynette. Row number three has Ryan Blaney and Sam Hornish Jr. Row number four will have Tony Stewart and Ricky Stenhouse Jr. Starting in row five will be Dale Earnhardt Jr. and Jim McMurray. Row 6, Kyle Larson starting 11th and 12th, Austin Rogers. Matt Kenseth in 13th and 14th, Kevin Harvick, that is row 7. Row number 8, Joey Logano and Bobby Labonte. Row 9 has Jeff Gordon and Brad Keselowski. Row number 10, Justin Allgaier starts 19th and Jamie Johnson starts 20th. Row 11, 21st, Kurt Busch, 22nd, Austin Dillon. Scott Speed in 23rd, Bill Elliott 24th, and that is row 12, and rounding out the field today is Tyson Aquino. Now here's your onboard cameras. Casey Kane with the Farmers Insurance on board. They'll be joined by Carl Edwards, he'll have the Dodge on board. Matt Kenseth will have the Toyota on board camera. Austin Rogers carrying the EA Sports on board camera. Brad Kozlowski carries our Ford EcoBoost on board camera. Kurt Busch will carry the Chevrolet on board camera. And finally, Austin Dillon will carry the Dow on board camera. We are just moments away from the race. Casey Kane leads the field to the green flag. Pace car on pit road. Casey Kane and Chase Elliott lead the field to the green flag. It's in the air and away we go! The field heads for turn number one. Casey Kane on the breakaway. Chase Elliott now has to deal with Carl Edwards. He's dealing with Carl Edwards as they go down the back for the way into turns three and four. Casey Kane on the breakaway. He's got a huge thing going on. What happened there? For the red, they are throwing out the caution. Kenseth is obviously not happy with that. I don't know what happened. First caution of the night. Let's take a look at what happened. Um, we're gonna see it right here. Oh, Kenseth got shot by Logano. Oh man, that's gonna be a tough break. So the green flag's gonna fly here on lap six of twenty-five. The pace car is on pit road. Green flag back in here. The Casey takes off the jump again. Casey K on the jump again as he breaks away into turn two. Down the back straightaway they go. Kaird, Carl Edwards now dealing with Chase Elliott again. Carl Edwards rounds off turn four. He'll take second. Three wide for second. Ryan Blaney gets it. Ryan Blaney has returned to around he goes. Around goes Blaney. The caution's out for the second time tonight. Ryan Blaney just spun out. Did he get loose or something? Casey Kane on the jump. There, there goes Blaney. Around he goes. Green flag's gonna fly again on lap 11 of 25. Casey Kane's gonna lead this race. Oh, wait, they're on. The, the sun's down. Green flag back in the air. Casey Kane once again on the jump. Edward Thumbin is gonna wait. They go into turns one and two. Carl Edward. Now chasing down Casey Kane. But Kane gets away. He'll lead lap 11. We're on lap 12 now. Lap number 12 on the board. Casey Kane breaking away. Side by side for a second. It's Chase Elliott and Carl Edwards. Carl Edwards now looking. Chase Elliott gets second. 
He's going at the first. And move, Chase. Oh, Chase, he came off lap 13. We're on 14 now. Look at him. We're on the play. Chase side by side. Down the back row with the Oh, Casey came in. Chase only gets the lead. Here comes Ricky Stenhouse Jr. Where did he come from? He's chasing him down. They're fucking. Okay. Here comes Stenhouse Jr. He takes the lead. Dylan! Justin O'Gara! Jimmy Johnson and Arnold! Oh no! Debris scattered everywhere. The red flag is out. Here on lap 15. Ricky Stenhouse Jr. is going to be the race leader. Let's take a look at what happened. Oh, it looks like he just got T-boned off the wall. And I wouldn't call it a T-bone. I'd call it a ricochet. Because watching this onboard of you from Austin Rogers here. Yeah, he ricochets off the wall and Johnson just had nowhere to go. He got T-boned on board with her board. Now Frank Kislowski. And it pretty much shows the same thing. Just why, is, why they showed it at different times is beyond me. So the field all has been frozen where they are. Look at the looking at at this field here as they sit still. The base car is in front of Ricky Stenhouse Jr. and Chase Elliott. NASCAR has decided that when the yellow flag is lifted, there will the yellow flag has been lifted and the cars are rolling away. Chase Elliott and Kyle Larson. Chase Elliott and Ricky Stenhouse Jr. for the field one last time. Justin Longer ricochets off the wall and Jimmy Johnson just had nowhere to go. So the green flag's gonna fly on lap 24. That was the call from NASCAR. Two laps to go. Stan has Jr. lead. Green flag's gonna fly right back through the air. Chase Elliott now on the brake. St Stanhouse didn't get going. Stanhouse spins the tires. They race for turn one. Chase Elliott on top of the field. Casey Kane not letting him get away though. Three wide behind the leaders. It's Jay McMurray in there. Kyle Larson's there. Nick Murray looks to the inside. He's gonna take the lead. He'll take second and first. Moon McMurray does a slide job. Troll! But Bonnie somehow gets out, gets out of this one as it's a four-color pilot. Caution's out, racing over. McMurray's gonna win this one. Let's take a look at what happened. This is bizarre because you don't see the you don't see it finish off until there. They line up double foul behind the base car and they take the checkered flag and the caution and the yellows. Jay McMurray wins the Coca-Cola folds over 500. Uh, you got it backwards, but I'm not going to complain about that. Jamie McMurray wins, and he's going to smoke him down here in the Folds of Honor Coca-Cola 500. And the celebration is on for McMurray in victory lane. Let's go take a look at your Folds of Honor Coca-Cola 500 race results. Jamie McMurray wins the race and has and led, led two laps, the final two laps. Chase Elliott finishes second. Casey Kane third. Fourth, Kyle Larson. Michael Annette fifth. Sixth, Kurt Busch. 7th, Ricky Stenhouse Jr., 8th, Tony Stewart, 9th, Sam Hornish Jr., and 10th, Carl Edwards. Jeff Gordon finishes 11th, Scott Speed 12th, Brian Blaney 13th, Dale Jr. 14th, Kevin Harvick 15th, 16th goes to Bobby Labonte, 17th, Bill Elliott, Austin Dillon 18th, 19th, Brad Kozlowski, Austin Rogers 20th, 21st, Tyson Aquino, Justin Allgaier 22nd, Jimmy Johnson 23rd, Matt Kenseth 24th, and rounding out the field, 25th, Joey Logano. Now let's take a look at your... Alpine Stars NASCAR Cup Series points after race 3 of 14. Jamie McMurray leads the points with 63 now. Chase Elliott is second with... And he's down by two. Carl Edwards down two spots. He's going to be third. Kyle Larson will be fourth. Ricky Stenhouse Jr. fifth. Kevin Harvick sixth. Ryan Blaney seventh. Sam Hornish Jr. eighth. Nath Kurt Busch. Tony Stewart rounds out the top ten. Eleventh place Bobby Labonte. Casey Kane twelfth. 13th, Jeff Gordon, 14th, Dale Earnhardt Jr., 15th, Bill Elliott, Justin Allgaier, 16th, Joey Logano, 17th, 18th, Michael Annette, Brad Keselowski, 19th, and 20th, Matt Kenseth, 21st, Jimmy Johnson, Austin Rogers, 22nd, Scott Speed, 23rd, Austin Dillon, 24th, Tyson Aquino, 25th, 26th, David Reagan, Chandler Caudill, 27th, 28th, A.J. Allmendinger, 29th, Kenny Johnson, Michael McDowell, 30th, 31st, Denny Hamlin, Cole Witt, 32nd, Reed Sorensen, 33rd, and 34th, Landon Castle. Everyone from AJ Allmendinger on back has no points. That'll do it for this week. End of Feed Good Night Satellite. Next week, we're headed off to Kentucky for the Alpine Stars NASCAR Cup Series. Until we meet again, I'm Scott Miles, and on behalf of everybody here on the Competition Racing Network, we're signing out. Transmission ends now.